Hello, in this video we will learn how to calculate FPI index for a calculation of a drought. Let me explain a bit. It is standardized precipitation index and it is widely used to calculate the drought, meteorological drought or something. So here is my data. I have prepared the data of different climatic models, example 6 like uh, Norris and, and uh, similarly. ESM and other others. So you need to organize the data in a similar way like in the months, starting with the months and, and uh, the other data in the same sequence. So you can make a CSV file and put it in, in, in my uh, uh, okay. So let's start from our First of all, we need to give the directory and set with in give the in the folder where the data is placed. But mine is on the desktop. So you can just click here and just copy the command. Paste here, but you need to change it a bit like uh, to this double slash area. Okay, so let's see. Right. Okay, so it's on its way. Let's see what's in the directory. So there are two files like two and uh, one in the codes to calculate SPI and the second is my file like CSV files so let's upload the CSV file here uh, we can upload it in data1 name data1 and uh, we can do read.csv command and in read.csv we can choose, we can choose files okay. So after choosing file, we can run this line. And here, the same folder will be uh, visible. And maybe if it's not visible, you can find the folder from the here left uh, bar. So you need to upload this file. So we are using now and open. So you can see here in the right one in the environment, set one is already uploaded. Having we have a body observation and. 11 uh, different variables so after that we will uh, for the calculation of uh, SPI we need to start package name as uh, SPI under SPI package uh, there are uh, other SPI uh, library and you need to install this first. So I already installed it. So I'm again installing for again installation. I'm just saying that uh, you need to restart your RD. So, okay. So it's already installed. Now we will install the library. Library of S and same and the package to install. Ready. So library is already installed. So we have to proceed about the calculation. Okay. We are going to calculate uh, like I give a name of data two. In data two, I can see that SPI. This one and this uh, one. Data one. We already uploaded the data and in that one we need to choose of which model we are going to use for calculation. We can select one by one. I'm choosing now X and M for Y. And, uh, and we can use comma and if we are going to calculate SPI3, then we can press 3. If we are going to use 6, then we press 6, similar 9, 12. 48, 24, 40, whatever you want to calculate, just place the number here. Okay, I'm going to calculate as pay 3. So let's open it. 
Let's start adding input in a file one to see what's uh, in the data to just run data to so here you can see the calculations in the console so a lot of videos I have found in the internet are having similar ways but uh, our main purpose is to extract the data in Excel form for the further calculations to extract the data in Excel form we have to enter dollar sign and keep it so it's our pretty values so it's already here 11 volt information from the pretty well so now we want to extract these fitted values into excel or csv so we can just try it as spdit but it's our spdit just name but you can use any other name as well so we will use the app data frame option as data frame and in as data frame we like the right fitted values this one will I name to it uh, in this way our data frame is created okay so this is our data frame spdit one variable in the output information so if we proceed further we can we can use the right uh, csv command in write csv we can just give a name spdit3 and uh, comma and file is equal to in here we will give the directory equal to the same directory we want to save the file in the same port so we can just try it our directory then we need to specify the uh, file name as well in this folder under the name of uh, er3.csv just run it so we can see under the folder of this one is not here 